vote that just happened. No, it's not upset. It's disappointed. I mean, look, here's the deal. Let me tell you something. Let me be real with y'all. What George was accused of doing is wrong. It's wrong what he was accused of doing. But he was accused. He hasn't even had his day in court. We are a nation of laws. We are not a nation of men. And if this institution is going to now ignore the rule of law because of political preferences and political decisions, it is going to be damning not just for the House, but it's going to be damning for the United States. We have a president of the United States who has flagrantly ignored the asylum law and has rewritten it to suit his own political interests and is destroying this country. And we're not even going to allow a member who was elected, regardless of how you feel about it, to have his full day in court. Until today, only five people have been expelled from the House of Representatives. Three of them fought for the Confederacy, and two were convicted in a court of law. And now we're saying that all it takes is a report from the Ethics Committee, and I respect the members on the committee. But now what we're saying is all it takes is a report from Ethics, voted out unanimously, to now expel members from the House. Is Chuck Schumer going to now bring a motion to the floor to expel Bob Menendez? I would hope the Senate would follow our lead, but I doubt that they will. What was